Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I have brought you along a car camping adventure right here at San Clemente State Beach. It seemed like the perfect time of the week to just come and enjoy two days at, at the beach. Apparently this is a really popular area. Reservations are really hard to get online. Somehow, thank God I got some. And I also got a pretty awesome campsite that'll be facing the beach. So far the weather is nice, it's 11.44 a.m. We are now going to check in, set up, get ready, get settled in, and uh, enjoy a relaxing time over here. I just found my camping area, it's site 85. I will be showing you like always around. I just really needed this. All right, let's get out of the car and get everything ready. There is a lot of space over here. I was going to bring my tent and just tent camp, but instead I'll be car camping and just enjoying my car, the comfort of my car. There is beach access behind me. There's a little small road that leads you down to the beach. Look at this view I'm going to get. All right, let me take all the stuff out. I also brought plenty of firewood for tonight. It's going to be an awesome time. Believe it or not, I've never done beach camping in California. This has been long overdue, and it just feels really good to be out here. There's nothing like being by the ocean, just hearing the waves. I'm gonna get this grill started. I brought some charcoal to start making the tilapia. Another uh, product I use just to start my fires, whether it's a bonfire or on the grill, are the Bigfoot Bushcraft. These fire plugs are super efficient, super easy to use. They stay lit for about five minutes. You can use either a, a striker to get them started or a lighter. And just like that, we got the fire going. Time to try out the taco, see how it tastes. Beach side. Mm. Perfect amount of flavor. Mm -hmm -hmm. What is the perfect pairing? <laughs> Jarritos. I'm pretty much done cleaning up, finally heading down to the beach to enjoy that beautiful view. The weather feels so, so good. 
we're almost there. There's this little pathway from the campsite area that takes you down to the beach. It's a really nice walk. The view is just beautiful. The breeze, amazing. And we're here. Wow, the water is so blue here. Finally done setting up this beach tent. It took me a little bit of time, only because I haven't used it in such a long time that I have forgotten how to set it up, but it's perfect. I got these little windows right here to let some breeze in. Most importantly, I have some shade. Just going to enjoy the rest of the day right here, relaxing. I brought my jackery, I brought, I brought my laptop, you know, check some emails, get some stuff done, but that'll be after. First, I'm just gonna relax, maybe take a little quick nap right here. I really like that this area is not so packed. I couldn't have asked for more. I have to say that this is only the second or third time I use my beach tent. Right now I'm gonna continue to, to work on my blog. I'm a little behind on my posts, so working on some content to upload to my blog. If you have not checked it out yet, make sure you do so www.questrunnerchannel.com I post a lot of the details and info that maybe I forget to show on the vlogs so you can find my trips there as well with just a more descriptive point of view with pictures and whatnot. Like I had said earlier, I really needed to get away and just enjoy two days. I was planning on going on a backpacking trip but then I was searching for just a different type of environment. The beach seemed perfect. You can never go wrong with the beach. The sun is slowly starting to set. There are a little bit of clouds, which is making it a lot better. That way the sun's not beaming in your face. It's already five o'clock. What I am seeing is that a lot of people are starting to come right now, mainly surfers. The surf is up. It's actually really nice right now. I'm finally done making some coffee, about to enjoy it with this beautiful view. The sun is already setting, the sky looks amazing, and I got my favorite Mexican bread. You can't go wrong with this.
So far this has been such a relaxing, amazing trip. It's just what I needed to recharge. I think the last time I went to the beach was like over a year ago. Enjoying the last couple of minutes. I think there's an hour left of sunlight. Then going to make my way back to the campsite, start the fire, start dinner and continue enjoying my time right here by the ocean. There's just something about the ocean, the sound of the waves, that really brings so much peace to you. Good morning. So last night after the bonfire, I was supposed to stay up and watch a movie. I got in the car, I laid down a little bit and I completely knocked out. I was I was just feeling so relaxed and tired. So it's already nine o'clock. I think this is the latest I've slept in while camping. I'm usually up at like six or seven. I have to leave the campsite by 12. That's the checkout time, 12 noon. I'm gonna make some breakfast, uh, clean up, rearrange my car, and then I'll probably just go spend the morning at the beach, make some hot chocolate there. I still have a, a piece of pan dulce. Anyways, good morning and yeah, let's get up. Finally done making some breakfast. This is not bad. The, the last time I made uh, something like this, I used bagels. I think they were cinnamon raisin. Yep, I'm definitely having one more. I will be coming back here. I'm gonna invite some friends and do like a two day trip or something. Done washing the dishes. Now it's time to clean up this mess in three, two, one. 
And just like that, we are ready to go. Everything's packed up, just gonna look around, pick up some trash, and, and I'll be on my way back home. Well, I did pick up some extra trash that other campers left. That's one thing I wanted to remind you all that make sure that you clean up and pack out just to make sure that we keep all the areas clean for other campers. It really goes a long way. Anyways, I'm going to just enjoy the rest of this view. Thank you all so much for joining me on this quick beach camping adventure. Like always, please do not forget to hit the thumbs up button, drop some comments, hit the notification bell, and subscribe to support the channel. Catch you guys on the next one.